Acre opening the uh, community centre. It's been a very long time in gestation, many years, and a, an awful lot of people have put a lot of time and, uh, uh, and, and effort into this. And, uh, and to, to be here today really feels like an enormous achievement. So I think we all deserve uh, to congratulate ourselves for, for getting this far. Um, when, when we had a strategy day recently, we, we decided that the three things which were important to us were actually very simply encapsulated in three word, words. Our vision is about inspiration, inclusion, and integration. So inspiration, we want to inspire people that live and work here to build a responsible community which allows businesses and individuals to thrive together. Um, in terms of our inclu inclusivity, we want everybody to feel included. That is, the haves and the have-nots. We are not a community centre just for one small section of society or any individual section. We want everybody to come here and to use this as a place where they, they meet. Um, and in terms of integration, we want to link together the various voices in Fitzrovia. There are lots of organisations which represent us. And there are a lot of things we have in common in terms of the vision. There'll be some things we disagree on, but we want to be the natural magnetic hub for everything Fitzrovia. So that, that's our vision, very simply encapsulated. And we're fortunate not just to live and work in this diverse and interesting part of town with its history, but we have lots of people here, businesses and individuals, who've got great skills to bring. And we're very grateful to everybody who does that and gives their time and money. And uh, we're also grateful to both Camden and Westminster for supporting us. We are unusual in that we straddle two boroughs. And uh, it is essential that we retain the support and enthusiasm of everybody in those, in those two boroughs. Um, in terms of what I have done as, as chair, when, when I came in, I've, I've only been uh, here for some, a little less than a year, but my, I thought that one thing I can contribute was to help sort out the, the corporate governance of us, to make sure that we have a really robust board of governors um, and, uh, and, and that we are very properly constituted and that we are self-sustaining as an organisation. We're not going to be able to rely on the sorts of uh, handouts that community centres have historically been able to, therefore partnership <coughs> with all our contributors uh, in the community, all our stakeholders, is really essential. Um, and the support that we've had from Camden, which we had in early stage support, has been really helpful in allowing us to make some long-term decisions in terms of recruiting uh, two excellent members of staff. So Pat Tullock, who is our centre director, and is waiting, <laughs> waiting is very, very modestly at the back there, next to her, Claire O'Regan, who is our facilities manager. Between them, they have some uh, amazing experience with um, city centre community centres, and they've already made a huge difference. So I'm, I'm really delighted that we have those on board. And I think with, a, with this strong corporate governance structure, talented staff, trustees and the support of the community, we will become that hub for Fitzrovia that we've all been asking for for so long. I'm now going to ask